Hello guys, today I want to quickly show you one eloquent relationship kind of trick which I found in the source code of my colleague Nerius who prepared this tutorial about live wire like dislike component and for that he wanted to get a relationship of a vote on a post by specific user. So this is the page, how it works. So you have a list of posts and you can like or dislike. And that dislike actually kind of reverts your like, like on any social network. And for that, we need to know whether that person already voted or not. So in the component itself of like dislike, we have a relationship of user vote, which may be null, and it comes from user vote from the post. And this is the actual part that I wanted to show you on post. We have many votes, but how do you get the one vote by a specific user who is logged in? This is the solution. And why I'm showing it to you? Because of one. And I haven't seen one used like this. That's why I decided to shoot this video. So what is one in general? First, the theory of Laravel and then how it is used here and what query is behind it. So one is quite a new addition in Laravel as a relationship of has one of many. It was released in Laravel 9.43 and I have a separate video on using that among with other ways to get the latest one row from the relationship. So I have five different ways listed here. I will link that video in the description below. But basically you have a relationship of user orders, for example, and you want to have latest order, which has latest of many, oldest order, or convert that with one. So that has one of many was released in 943 and that one is even newer addition in Laravel framework. So in the releases page in 10.4, you can find this pull request, allow converting has many into has one. So in the documentation, we can see orders has many, but if you want one of many, you can find the syntax. But if we go back to the syntax that my colleague Nerius has used, it's even different, but it actually works surprisingly well. So we get one vote with where condition. And then in the controller, we can see we have votes with user vote, with logged in user. And as a result, if we refresh that page and see the debug bar queries, there's one query querying all the votes for the posts, which is eager loading, but also adding where user ID logged in user. So this is kind of a trick I found useful, not sure if it's really applicable that often, but I hope you find it useful too. And in the comments below, share your experience, how you do such operation in Eloquent. And if you want the original article of Livewire like dislike component, I will also link that in the description below. But that's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.